Hey, what's going on ladies and gents welcome back to another genshin impact video i'm your friendly neighborhood content creator now listen i wanted to talk to you guys about yai miko's banner because it's just about to be announced almost through the 2.4 live stream and i wanted to make a little bit of a prediction of what it might look like now for yai miko's banner obviously we're going to have the five star character being yai miko and we're going to probably have another character banner and i'm thinking it would be the raiden shogun banner and it would be pretty interesting what kind of four stars would be on that banner because previously we had we had Kujo Sara on that banner, but now we probably will not. We'll have some other four star character, but it could also be Kujo Sara at the same time. Now, obviously, if it is Kujo Sara, it would make sense because the Raiden Shogun is also rerunning. However, I'm not quite sure if they're going to release a new four star character. So I I'm not really sure about that. Even though it has been a really long time since we've seen Sara in a banner. Um, it seems highly unlikely that Genshin is going to release her alongside these banners as well. So I'm thinking another 4-star Electro character would be on that banner. We currently have Beidou on the banner, so it's definitely not Beidou. And I don't think it would be Razor either, because I'm not sure if it would be appropriate. So I'm thinking Fizzle is almost a guaranteed to be on that banner. It's just been so long since Fizzle has been on a banner. And it would be the perfect opportunity since, he, you know, she's an Electro character. It would be on these banners. So I would definitely put Fischl on those banners as well. So now we have a different type of support that we want on this banner. So maybe a character like similar to Yenfei maybe. Or, you know, Noel Bennett Rosaria have already been in the album. Beto and Eula banner that has rerun. So I'm not quite sure if they're going to be on this banner either. So I would be guessing maybe Sucrose or Diona would be on this banner just because they want some sort of diversity in the banner as well. So if Diona does come to this banner, it will make it pretty balanced having Fischl, Diona, as well as Yaimiko, as, as well as the other banner being the Raiden Shogun. So I would suggest if they do have Sucrose on it as well. Sucrose is an excellent character. I 100% you guys do build her. She is really, really good, especially if she's stack elemental mastery on her. And if you have a bunch of constellations on her, especially C6. For Diona, Diona is also a really good shielder. She will help you a lot. She goes based upon HP percentage. So I would also suggest you guys building her as well. She's an excellent healer slash shielder. Very good support for any of you guys wondering if you guys need a shielder support. She's going to be fantastic. So if any of these units do come on there, it will be pretty good. Having Fish will also be alongside them. You could pretty much make a whole team if these two do come along. Now for the third character that I wanted to talk about that has a potential, you know, chance of coming back into these banners. It has to be in yeah now jinyan hasn't been in a popular banner recently and since we just seen her in the lantern right we might actually see jinyan in the future jinyan is a character that's very niche if you want a character that you know just does physical damage this is the character for you even though she does do some sort of shielding you know she has the increase in attack percentage and you know attack speed but I, I just don't think she's that great of a character, but I do plan on building her just to see what I can do with her on my mini account. So yeah, that's going to be pretty much my banner predictions. So it, it would be Yaimiko and Ryan Shogun, and then we'll have Fischl, and then we'll have a character like Sucrose or Diona, and then we'll have Jin Yan. That is going to be my banner predictions. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Am I going to be close? Let me know when the banner comes out in the comment sections. I will be checking all of them out. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, consider liking this video, subscribing to the channel as well. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. What kind of characters is going to be coming out. Your banner predictions are going to be. And I'll see you guys in the next video very soon. Goodbye.